almost a four. And uh, here, and I'm going to go back to, I guess, one of the usual tops I talk about, which is the opioid epidemic. And a uh, very interesting new study that shows that um, within a quarter of adults that went to the emergency room for a sprained ankle, we were prescribed opioids, kind of showing the fact that, you know, uh, doctors don't get sufficient assistance. Sufficient, excuse me, sufficient training in pain management or the mechanics of pain. Thereby, basically, by the prescribing the opioids, helping to increase the opioid epidemic and you know, have people who become addicted. But see, not only has that shown how little doctors have been trained in you know pain management and the mechanics and all that of how pain works, but now. <clears throat> what the Trump administration government is doing is that they're doing a complete and utter fucking reversal. And that is that they set it up so that way <clears throat> doctors prescribing opioids, you know, um, there's much more of a detriment to it. So doctors are more likely to lose their fucking licenses and all that. And while in the attempt of preventing there to be, you know, any type of you know, corruption or anything that could lead to addiction, they're also... Uh, throwing, but uh, they're also throwing people who have chronic pain, who are desperately in need of pain medication, under the bus. Fuckers who are, who have horrible, extremely bad chronic pain, now have to suffer and have to worry about having their doses cut, thereby basically ruining their um their their lives. You know their, uh, you know their ability to provide for their family, to do any fucking thing. So basically, in a sense, is that Trump ain't doing shit except fucking, except fucking people up, which is, I guess, not unusual considering his track record. At any rate, having said all that, it is also so important to remember this is a complicated fucking issue, um, one that I. Uh, you know, we'll continue to go over and kind of uh, talk about it and following up videos, of course, as I always have. That being said, oh uh, well, that's helpful. So, what's going on if a guy says a girl has a red scare in her Harry Truman? Sense. <laughs> uh, uh, uh.